Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Veronica and on this channel I do decorating, DIYs, and some crafts. If you like what you see in this video, please subscribe so you see more in the future. My goal for today is to take down all Christmas stuff. I love the season, but I'm just so overworked and just kind of tired of looking at it. I just want to start the new year off really fresh. I am going to keep all of the winter themed items up. So some of the garland I will keep up. Anything that's really winter themed like the, the birchwood candles I'm also going to keep. I will be keeping these poinsettias because they're still alive and thriving. They do add a little red to the room, which is okay. Um, I'm going to add a red tinted glass candle to the table behind this one and it will complement the poinsettias really well in this room. Also these birch wood luminaries are perfect for winter so they will stay as well. I added a smaller piece of garland and also some pine comb picks. This candle was a dollar at Michael's. It's called Peppermint Bark. It smells so nice. Taking down the Christmas tree is just the biggest task. I never realized how much stuff I put on this tree, all the ornaments and all the ribbon. It's really a lot once I take it down. I'm going to be taking all the ornaments off, but I will be leaving the tree up. I don't know about trees, but traditionally greenery and um, evergreens were brought into the home just to remind us that spring was on its way. So I just want to leave this tree up just for a little bit longer, probably not too much longer, um, but along with the garland, I do want to bring more green here. I will be organizing this later, but this, almost all of this came from my tree. I got this giant nutcracker from Michaels for half off uh, a couple weeks ago, and I'm just loving him. He'll be great for next year. I will be putting away these lampposts as well. So at Michael's, all Christmas stuff is 75% off, and I bought these LED candles. In each package, there's 10 of them, and it comes with a remote control. They also come with clips. I bought two packs of these, so I have 20 of them. I've always wanted these lit candles um, that were battery operated. I'm going to use them now to add some lights to my tree. I'm just going to clip them on. They will also be great for next year. I'm 
am one of those people who really do love winter. I love the change of the seasons. I love how the earth seems so quiet during the winter and everything is just renewing and it's going to be fresh again in the springtime. I'm going to add these neutral placemats and just a really simple blue vase with white flowers and winter picks in them. Less color and more neutrals definitely feels fresh and serene in this space. This Christmas mantle was my favorite space during the holidays. I'm just going to remove the regular Christmas stuff such as the mailbox, the Santa Claus, and the lamppost. I'm going to keep the garland along with the, the winter pine combs and I will probably add a few more winter picks to this area. I quickly wanted to show you my Christmas slash winter scene. Now it's just a winter scene. It has these cute miniature snow covered trees and white ceramic houses. And I love anything miniature. So I think this will be really perfect for the month of January. I glued some twigs to a battery tea light to make a small bonfire. You can see the flickering of the fire through it. This is a beautiful winter woodland wreath that I just added a neutral ribbon and some winter foliage to. This completes my winter decorating. I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching. See you next time.